Hi, it's Tom from Genki RC here. Just gonna give you a quick overview of what I've done to modify my ERC time salve needle cutter to a uh, laser engraver stroke cutter. So basically we've got the main module. Uh, ordered this one on Banggood. Um, it's running the zip on its own power supply. And then you've got the PWM module here. So you've got PWM plus and then the negative they go to your Z plus and your ground on your Arduino unit. It's got the Gerbil 1.1 uh, in the Arduino and then we're running laser GOB, uh, GOBL on the laptop. As you can see here, I've got uh, just a 20 mil circle uh, set up. And all I need to do is reload that file select the material I want, so I've got the um, 160 balsa, it's going to be at 90%, 800 millimeters per minute and two passes, so we click apply on that one, click create, and then click run, It'll also cut um, one, one eighth balsa as well. Um, that's on 100% at uh, similar speed. And again, four, pla four passes to do that. So it's all good stuff. The last thing I should mention is that you must always make sure you wear your safety goggles when you uh, use a laser. And that includes anybody in your workshop. So if you've got one in your workshop and um, you've only got one set of goggles, then make sure you lock your door and don't let anybody in. While, uh, while you're operating, because uh, it could seriously damage their eyes. And finally, um, I've got a little bit of work to do with cable management. I've got some um, cable chains printing on a 3D printer at the moment, which would be nice to uh, tidy up the wiring. Um, but the main reason for the conversion is to, um, to have a go at doing some also uh, plane builds. I've done quite a few of the um, like test foam boards with the, the needle cutter now but um, wanted to try something different anyway like and subscribe and I'll uh, see you soon bye